Music of Southeast Asia. Music of Southeast Asia is a sub-region of Asia. It is consists of two geographic regions. The one is mainland section. The second is maritime section. The mainland region is composed of Cambodia, Laos, Myanmar, Thailand, and Vietnam. The second is maritime region is composed of Brunei, Indonesia, Malaysia, Philippines, and Singapore. Let us try to chapter review in your module in lesson 2 about the music of Southeast Asia. The one is the two important musical cultures among the people of Southeast Asia are the Gong Chaim culture and game orchestra. Like some of areas in the musical culture in reach of the place in frames provided by the gold makers. Example, a gong agol kimpal is usually the large of small hanging bronze gong. The second is linang kitok, a bronze kital gongs. The second is the music of Indonesian of demonstrate culture or diversity having seen influenced by Indian and Chinese music. In the various native Indonesian tribes often use the chants and song of accompanied by the musical instruments and their rituals. So today the mother of music of Indonesia is a popular region especially in Malaysia, Singapore, and Brunei. So the tempo of Indonesia music is called Erama. There are a fast and slow tempo in their music. In Malaysian music reflects the specific ethnic groups of multiracial Malaysian society consisting of Chinese, Indian, or Russian, and other groups. The fourth one is Laosian music, may be categorized as having an earthier feeling and rather compelling and effective. The instrument was supposedly invented by a woman trying and imitate the calls of Garawik birds. This is the most distinctive love musical instrument. This is a popular by the bamboo mouth organ. It's called Ken, which sounds of like a bagpipe. Kabunjan art music is highly influenced by the Persian well Hindu forms. In Cambodia, is called the diversity of populate the country of the heart in mainland of Southeast Asia. It has the glorious history of during the Angkor or the Empire. It was considered the powerful of the country and with the advanced civilization. The sixth one is the traditional Vietnamese music. It is a highly diverse and combining native and foreign influence. This is what we call what you call the Vietnam, and the Vietnam has a highly developed by the musical culture similar of Thailand. It is a usual style of chamber music and using the harp or primary instruments. The most notable feature of the traditional Vietnamese music is that the bass of the five notes and scale. The seventh one is the traditional music of Myanmar of melodious Melodious by generally without harmony. So the Myanmar lies in the westernmost part of the Southeast Asia near in Bangladesh, India, China, and Laos. 
The eighth one is the folk music of Singapore includes ethnic Chinese and Malay influence. In the Singapore, is an island country of Southeast Asia near by Malaysia. It is one of the world leading commercial centers. The folk music of Singapore includes the ethnic Chinese, Malay, Tamil sounds. It is an urban music scenes of included by the rock, punk, and the other register of music. Number 9 is Brunei musical style has a strong Islamic influence which means the dance performance and music are somewhat restricted. In the Brunei has a wide array of native folk music and dance. Brunei shares some cultural, cultural perspectives and link with other countries of Southeast Asia such as Malaysia, Singapore, Indonesia, Thailand, and Philippines. Number 10 is the vocal system of the Thai music is similar to the pentatonic scale of China. In Thailand, the music of Thailand reflects in geographic position at the intersection of China and India. It has also reflect the trade routes that have been historically included by the Persia, Africa, Greece, and room. So the Thailand has a considerable number of living art. So the musical instruments are varied and reflect by the including Klota and Kim. This is what you called by the origin of Persians. So kids, that's all for today. Have another discussion on the next meeting. Please update and monitor your e-class online learning system. Thank you and goodbye everyone.